My name's Kim, my mom is Nancy, and mom is 78 years old. Growing up, if we needed anything, she was always there for us. I started to notice things, the same questions asked over and over again. We were worried about people taking advantage of her and her finances. She has a very giving heart, so anything that came in the mail, she would send them a check. The house that she lived in for 50 years was way too big. She wasn't always good at taking medications like she was supposed to. Mom was gonna definitely need more help. My husband had a stem cell transplant in 2016. Being John's caregiver 24-7, 365 for two years, I was spent. The, the toll that that took on my health over the two year period with John, I couldn't, I knew I couldn't do it again. I felt so guilty, mom took care of me. How can you not take care of her? And I would just sit on the front porch and cry. John did pass away. We looked around and when we walked in, my daughter said, I could live here. I said, I think I could too. <laughs> the care that mom has received here has been phenomenal. During the pandemic, what would I have done every day to keep her occupied? Having mom relocate to an assisted living community was one of the most difficult decisions, but also one of the best. I am so happy that my mom is here, close to me and my family, knowing that she is safe, she's cared for, she's loved. Mom has a huge heart. When people tell me I have a big heart, it comes right from my mom.